Hello. Today we're going to be working with a template designed to use with Storyline. These templates are designed with interaction in mind. We will provide the base layer so that you can focus on adding your hot spots and interactions on top. Let's get started. The first interaction type will be matching. On the left side, you have space for four different types of choices that your learner will match with four different types of answers. Don't forget to scramble your answers on the right so that your learners have to think about which choices match. Here is a pick one template with an area to add an image, a description, and a choice between two answers. This could be a good template to use if you've just taught your learners to recognize a new concept and want to test their knowledge in a low stakes way. Give them a chance to practice identifying that concept by selecting the correct choice. Let's talk surveys for a moment. They're a great way to gauge how your learners are reacting to the content. Write your survey questions on each of the lines provided. Next, export this template into Storyline so that you can animate each of the radio buttons to allow your learners to select their response. Sometimes, you need to present information to your learners, but you don't want to overwhelm them. This would be the perfect time to use cards to give them a little information at a time. Write one or two keywords on one side of the card. Then, in Storyline write out the full description of the card on the back, allowing your learner to reveal the information on click. Finally, we have scenarios. Scenarios are a great way to allow your user to make a choice based on the information provided to them. Have the avatar acting as a character in your narrative and use the choice buttons to allow your learner to test their knowledge. Keep an eye out for other Storyline templates that will release so that you can speed up your course building process. That's all for this one.